Park, explain to us your process before you go into the studio. Process. This is my process. You can see that camera man? This is my process. You can see? This is my process, you know, I drink this. You know, I don't give a fuck. See, you're not even paying attention, man. See, this is how I, I drink Hennessy, you know what I'm saying? I drink Hennessy, and I'm always writing. Anywhere I go, everything I do, I'm always right. I can even write on a toilet bowl. You know what I'm saying? I can write three songs on a toilet bowl. I cut the track, boom, it's done. My name is Tupac Amari Shakira, and I'm 25 years old. What do you do for a living? <laughs> I am a poet, I am a revolutionary, I am a speaker of the truth, I am an artist. What does thug life mean? Thug life is for the underdog. Thug life is for the person that's nobody's rooted for. Thug life is for the person that's trying to rise up out of the ghetto. Thug life is the rose that's coming from the concrete. That's what thug life is. What makes you the greatest rapper of all time? What makes me the greatest rapper? I'm the greatest rapper of all time. <laughs> because I speak the truth. It's Pac, Machiavelli. In the studio, drunker than a motherfucker. <laughs> This instrumental, uh. After the fire comes the rain. After pleasure, there's pain. We go, we go for the moment. We ball in the game. Try to make up my military. Be preparing a bus to sell the bitches. to scared me to hear me rush. The bitches are over practice. Millions of niggas dog living. Precious, big strap. Hope they don't tell us. And if we're here, I'm gonna mission the grace. Put on a sound as we slide down. This is in place. They got me feeding for currency. The money we call is like a dream in the season. We born sophisticated. And it's fucking misbehavior. Got the cop four or five. Got your niggas' papers. Label the mark. Two as we start. It was hard to quit. Starting out and drinking forties. The hard shit. God damn, now I'm a grown man. I follow no man. Nigga got my own plan in my hand. Got the 45. I keep it live to survive. Make these niggas die. But getting high, though we cry when these thugs bugs Niggas are leaving their caskets That's what you get for being bread hating bastards Everybody else wanna talk about well, how much money they got, how much bitches they got But I talk about the streets, I talk about the poverty I talk about what's going on inside the ghetto That's what I talk about Nobody else don't talk about that Nobody else don't talk about how a man don't survive Or how a man don't take care of his kids I talk about that Nobody talks about that So I talk about the truth I talk about what people don't see Or what people think they see But I talk about the honesty of the hood. I talk about what's in the ghetto. That's what I talk about. I don't hold no I don't hold nothing. First time I started acting, I was I did a show for Jesse Jackson, he was running for president, and he did a show in the Apollo Theater in nineteen eighty four. And I did a play called Raising the Sun, written by Lorraine Hasbury. You know what I'm saying? And I played Travis Walker. And once those curtains opened up and I saw all those audience and then after the show everybody was applauding I was I was on fire I was on point like yeah this is it this is it this is what I had to do you know just that that bug that I caught that acting bug that everybody was talking about I think what makes me so passionate about acting is the ability to look at the truth in the core of the character the ability to look at myself like I do every day look at myself and know where the truth comes from when I get a new character from the script I always you know figure out how this character looks how this character walks how this character dresses you know it's always got to be different from me but it, there has to be some truth from me implied into this character 
or it won't be truth at all. Right, are these people in the room with you right now? Are these good, good people to be around? Yeah, they're good. They are. Yeah, they're good. Where were they when you, when you got into trouble with the rape? Now they was they was there. So why didn't they stop it? <laughs> so I don't even want. I don't, I don't want well, I, I don't even want to talk about the rape. I do have some regrets. You know what I'm saying? I wish. I wish I would have kept my eyes open on the situation. But a bitch is a bitch. Slapping a bitch on the ass because I was sleep. Slapping a bitch on the ass, and I get locked up. Yo, you tell me when something, you tell me that's right? You tell me that there's something wrong with us, just as the judicial system? We trouble you, the dumber you from west side niggas die When they try to infiltrate my crew, we never hide We ride and die together And when you see my click, we always ride forever Me, my whole click is sick We smoke sissy B Can you pimp Mr. G? That they can't come against me You can't see me on TV All live niggas die When they try to come against me Never hide in my own zone In my own zone In my mind, I'm a gun Niggas knew it once I came over Splash that niggas will lie Dash Shit, niggas want something nasty, niggas I'll be bad as nigga is Steve Machiavelli I can hear the dawn of this whole clicking niggas you so sick That's my freestyle drunken folks Just so you bitch ass niggas in the back row no. you, you went to jail because of what a black woman said How do you feel about black women? I love black women Why? I love black women, I love, I love and respect black women my mother's a black woman. My mother's a powerful black woman. My mother's a strong black woman. My sister's a strong black woman. But you have women, and then you have bitches. And I don't know why they always come at me with that, like, oh, I shouldn't be saying a bitch. Look, bitches are out there. Bitches know who they are. They know what they represent. You know, a bitch is a bitch who want to get something out of you, who want to get what they can out of you. That's a bitch. A woman wouldn't do that. But a woman, like my mother, who will be there, who will provide for you the best that she can, even when she's down her luck, even when she's doing all kinds of nonsense, when she's doing all kinds of uh, smoking the drugs and all that, you know, she's there for you. She's a queen. That's a woman. That's a black woman. So I respect black women, just like I respect black power. You know, my stepfather, he was a Black Panther, but, you know, he was just a hustler like the next man. There was another dude that was raising me. He would give me money here and there, but there was nobody that to guide me. You know, my mother was there all the time. But I'm going to be honest, and I hate saying this because white people love hearing this, but you can't, a woman can't teach a man how to be a man. You know what I'm saying? A woman can't teach a man how to be a man. She can't give them the same type of manhood that a man can so a man has to teach a man. I didn't have that. I didn't have a man to guide me and say, this is what you need to be in life. Whether it's New York or Texas, Ryan Dunn and Alexis or BMW, I trouble you going up forever, this big old W. <laughs> but the Bruce, I'm a big rap star. Fuck the room, niggas, where you at? Where you are is the back, in the front. Where you pump to shit, I keep a cat inside my trunk, legit. Always, though I'm on probation, I still rock the nation. I don't bail, though like shit, I was a generous hell. Until I get my mail, will I fail? Hell, nah, niggas, rock my nails. I keep a manicure, throw you at a girl. Still gon' die with pocket high, smoking indoors. I roll my window down, a smooth criminal. Until I pack this pal, three, five, seven, or four, five. Will I hide? Will I die? Will I ride? Niggas never know why. My whole crew, a family click. Are we sick or we die? But we struggle to survive in this motherfucking nine five, turning nine six, nine six, turning nine seven. I keep a three, five, seven, back eleven. Back home, I got an MR. What I say? I'm in the 14. Haha, <laughs> my double R. Ride with my crew. Ride with my crew. We don't have a clue. Niggas, but we coming for you. We in the house of blue. I feel like fools. My nigga made him. Put a gun inside his club and keep his fucking three net on. Had him. Niggas inside his chest. Nah, nah. Niggas inside his belly. Nah, nah, nah. It was like a belly. I told him bring that sky. So I was free. I say, yo, Fado, what you crazy? Niggas, this is outside the front. Niggas say, God damn, that nigga's funny as hell. What you want? Pop, you went to high school with Jada Pinkett. Can you, can you talk about your relationship with Jada? Yes. 
Jada is my heart. Jada is my heart. She's my soul. She can have my lungs. She can have my liver. She can have every part of my organs. You know, we'll go all together. We're like Ozzy Davis and Ruby D. You know, she is a friend of mine. You know, that's my sister. That's my that's more than a sister. You know, she can tell she's the only one besides my mother that could tell me anything. I love her to death. You all never dated. I'm proud of her. That's for me to know. You do find out. I'm asking. Uh, that's for me to know. You do find out. But uh, I don't want to say anything that's going to get me into trouble because Jada's is the type of person that she will come to my house and she would straighten me out. And I don't mean in a sexual way. <laughs> Can you talk about your 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 friendship with with Mike Tyson? Ah. Mike Tyson is my role, though. That's my homie. See, Mike Tyson and I are like the same. You know what I'm saying? You know, he's big. I'm small. But we both got the same bark. We both got the same bite. You know, we attack. Anybody that comes towards us, we attack with full force. So we're the same. Nobody can control us. Nobody can handle us. So that's why we click. Speaking of a former relationship that you had with um, Notorious B.I.G. You guys used to be friends. What happened? We gotta bring that fat fucker up, man. Come on, man. He ain't had nobody when he was with me. Okay, he's the one that had to sleep on my couch. He's the one that had to beg for me for a token to get on the subway to go home. When he had a home. Okay, I'm the one that gave him his first start. Now he want to talk about how, oh, he's Big Papa and all this other stuff. You know what I'm saying? These niggas, I thought they were my homeboys. These niggas wasn't my homeboys. All right? They're the ones that shot me up. So you can imagine how I feel. You can imagine how I feel when I go up in there and these niggas are setting me up. Blast niggas, blast. I don't even know who these niggas are. And they ain't talking about they don't know. So you can imagine how I feel. Biggie, I thought he was my homeboy. I thought he was my roadie. But, you know, I see. If you could tell Biggie Smalls a message, look into the camera right now and, and give him a message. <laughs> Watch your back, motherfucker. Watch your back. Watch your motherfucking back. You ain't a real pimp. You think you a pimp? You think you a G? Watch your motherfucking back, nigga. Watch your back. Are you threatening him? <laughs> what you think? Yo, yo, I got all right, yo, yo, yo. See, yo, see this is this is this is what my problem is with you, motherfuckers. All right, yo, all that niggas sit and do it just, it's just drink, shit, and smoke. Okay, we got two weeks to cut this album. You know what I'm saying? We got two weeks, and I don't have time. I don't have time for y'all to be bullshitting. You know what I'm saying? If y'all just come in here, do the track, spit a little here. I do the track, spit a little here. I do the track, and y'all just bounce, man. But y'all sitting in here drinking, y'all smoking, man. You know what? I appreciate y'all help, but why don't y'all just get the fuck out? All right? Give me this shit. I got a problem. Y'all just get the fuck out. All right? I'll see y'all when I see y'all out there. Y'all just wait for me. Y'all just get the fuck out. All right? I just got to do this shit. All right? Close the door. Get the fuck out. I did a dope ass show. You niggas always remember me. Okay, literally. Bellissimo. What's the call? Me and the guy got Versace on Mario. All those niggas wanna fuck me. Oh, you know? Always representing my people to the fullest. Yeah, that same motherfucker that took five bullets. Come. Came out. Rapping. Still making five. Motherfucker records I sold millions, millions. Ha <laughs> ha. I made five rappers. You know what I'm saying? Niggas can't fuck with me. Tobacco lips. Now, no saying. 
I took shots, I gave shots, fuck the cops. The last time I took my shit, we just the top screw. Because that day would have do me. It's a mob thing. That boy in boots is. <laughs> Y'all niggas can't stop me, never drop a nail, never make me fall. Beat to my clips all around, dudes, ball, ball, ball. My crew, survive, reincarnation after I'm dead, and rock and roll, and bring the punk to the nation. Yeah, you know. Each one of these niggas gotta go, my name on the dope. That's what the game so crazy, playing on the dope. When I'm dead, the niggas die for me. Kill everybody. Each gotta see the pick a name on all part. <sighs> what will your legacy be? I want my legacy. I want my legacy to be that I help people. That I'm an angel sent for God. That I told the truth. That I s speak the truth. That I wanted to enlighten the world. I'm not saying I'm going to change the world or, or, or take over the world. But I guarantee I will spark the brain that changed the world. I want to let the young little kids know from the ghetto that you can do anything you want to do. That you can rise from all of this ghetto. You can rise from all of this poverty. You can rise from all of this nonsense. And you can do it. You just keep your head up. Keep your head up and everything will be all right. After the fire comes the rain, after the pleasure there's pain You be over drunk for the moment, you ball in the day You try to make your my military be preparing a bus It's similar to bitches, it's scary to hear it be busted Bitches are over practice, millions of niggas dog living Precious, big strap, hope they don't tell us They want a heater, I'm gonna mission the grace we put out a sound, as we slide down This is in place, they got me Feeding it for currency, money, we call us Like a dream in sinking season We born and sophisticated And it's fucking misbehavior Got the cop, four, five, got your niggas papers Label the mark, two as we start It was hard to quit, starting out and drinking forties With the hard shit, god damn, now I'm a grown man I follow no man, nigga got my own man In my hand, got the 45 I keep getting loud to survive Make these niggas die, while getting high the we Cry when these thugs bug niggas are leaving their caskets. That's what you get for being bread hitting asses. Me and my Chris on the jet, we make the 50 on us niggas know you can't touch us when we get to come against us. We think this need defenses, it's senseless. Knock a niggas back on their fences. My whole clique be sick, and though we rip old crews, niggas knew we came through drinking 22s of brute. And though we drip, and the seas we roll by the enemies with no shit. The auto boy so legit. I read my name out. Not I can barely with the dog like tied on the bottom of my belly Can these niggas understand this? My whole family is sick, it's so scandalous Let's introduce my clique 